In today's Throwback Thursday video, we're going to be taking a look at an older figure. It's the Star Wars Legacy Collection Ak Rev. Hey there, Star Wars collectors, and welcome to another Bosk's Bounty video. As mentioned in the intro, this is Throwback Thursday. Glad to be doing this video again. Obviously, the last few weeks we have missed the episode because we've had new figures to open and everything. So. But it's back again, Throwback Thursday, and this week we do have Ak Rev. He is part of the Legacy Collection. He is one of the drummers in Jabba's Palace. And as you can see, I think in the bubble there, you can see that he comes with half a drum. If you watched a previous video of mine of the Throwback Thursday series, you saw that we did Umpa Stay. He was the 30th anniversary figure, and he also came with half a drum. So obviously when we get this figure out, we're going to be able to join that drum together and have them both sides and have them reenact that scene from the special editions I do believe. So all right let's have a quick look at the packaging of this Legacy Collection figure. So there he is in the bubble. He is an older figure so it is in a bit of a bit of a sorry state the bubble there. It's got a bit of a mark on it from the price label and whatever. It's part of the droid factory line so you did get a piece of a droid to build a piece of R7Z0. Get his leg there as you can see. There's the back of the card, BD-5, and we can see some other figures in the wave there, BD-1, Han Solo, Luke Skywalker. Some pretty good figures in this wave, uh, and in this line in particular, but he cannot stay in that package any longer. He does need to come out, because obviously we do have the Jabba's Palace now, which came out this year, so I want to get as many of the figures that I can to create that scene uh, so here we go, let's open the package and see what the figure's like. All right, so here's the figure out of the pack. It's Ak Rev. I think that's how you pronounce it anyway. Um, and as you can see, it's a great looking figure. Loads and loads of detail and loads and loads of great paintwork. Really colorful figure here. Loads of color on his outfit. And as I mentioned, I do believe that he was in the special editions. So when they changed the scene uh, of the Jabba's Palace song, with the Max Rebo band and all that. You know, these guys, the this guy, Ak Rev and Umpaste, were there banging the drums, and I don't think they were in the original film. At least I can't remember it. It's been quite a long time since I watched the original cut of The Return of the Jedi. Um, obviously, we've had the DVDs and special editions and Blu-rays and whatever ever since with all the new, the new footage. Uh, but as you can see, he's got a great-looking facial sculpt there with plenty of detail. Um, and also on the back of the figure, some nice hair braids going on there. Lovely shoulder pads. As I say, loads and loads of colour. Reminds me a bit of a Rastafarian type effect there with his hair and the colours and everything. Um, but yep, so it goes pretty well with him being a musician and what have you. He does come with two drumsticks there as well. Now the only thing that I would say again about this figure, and it's the same with the Unpass Stay, is that his legs are in this position basically. You can't move the knees. So... He's got one leg straight out and one curved. He does have swivel hips and he does have ball jointed ankles. So you've got a little bit of movement in there, but the restriction on the knee, knees is a little bit odd, I must say. He does have ball jointed elbows and shoulders, so you can get lots of range going with his, with his arms, swivel wrists and a ball jointed head. And he has a swivel waist as well. So plenty of articulation in the figure, except for the knees. Now, as I mentioned, with the figure, you do get half of a drum. So let me just show you that drum now. So this is the half you get with this figure. And obviously, the, the first half came in the 2007 30th anniversary edition of Unpass Stay. And if I just show you that now. So there you go. So this one came in 2008, this one in 2007. And uh, it's quite nice that they did that, really. Two separate lines, two figures from the same scene and then you can just join that drum together like that and it fits in nicely at the bottom like that. Slight colour difference with the bottom bit, one's a lot more matte black and one's more of like a sort of a gunmetal grey black but that's okay, you can't no notice it too much and the rest of it fits nicely together so you've got the drum there so then obviously you can have it set up um, with both drummers on either side, which I'll do now for you. All right then, okay, so there you go. It's set up with the drum with figure either side. So you've got Akrev there and Umpa Stay there. I think this will look grey in the Jabba's Palace. As you can see, the figures are of a, a different size. So Umpa Stay is a much sort of bulkier figure than Akrev. 
obviously they're different species so that's absolutely fine uh, both 3.75 inch figures and I just think they look pretty awesome there on that drum and as I said it's going to look great in the Jabba's Palace scene with all the other figures so if you can imagine that we've got this guy in there as well massive figure that we've done on another throwback Thursday some of Jabba's goons we can get Leia in there so yeah awesome to be able to create that scene so what do you think then guys of this throwback Thursday figure we'll just get him out again now so you can see him in detail it is Ak Rev great looking figure loads of color and as I mentioned if you're going to be creating that Jabba's Palace scene then you probably want the both of them so you get both pieces of the drum and both figures let me know your thoughts in the comment section below thank you very much for watching on this throwback Thursday video once again appreciate all your support subscribe to the channel if you're new hit that like button of course and we shall see you on the next one